Penn State has always prided themselves on balance as far as the run and the pass, and obviously, as seasons progress, they react to what kind of personnel they have. Our John Stroh takes a deeper look into what kind of balance Penn State is striving for in 2009. One of the questions circling the Nittany Lions this week as they prepare for Temple is a lack of balance on offense, particularly the struggling ground game. For the first two games, Penn State has managed only 214 yards rushing, something head coach Joe Paterno partially credits to the number of eight-man fronts the Lions have faced this season. You know, I would hope when, when we stop getting the uh, wrong blitzes on, you know, they, I think Syracuse blitzed all maybe eight times. I think we had the ball about 67 times, and I think all but maybe eight or nine times they blitzed. So, you know, when you're facing that, uh, we tried to be stubborn and tried to, you know, run the ball because I think we need to work. Penn State's 94th ranked rushing attack is a work in progress as they managed only 78 yards rushing against Syracuse. However, offensive tackle Dennis Landel believes the Lions know how to fix the running game. As a whole, um, staying on some blocks and stuff, like we're getting there sometimes and not staying on long enough, just working on, you know, to the timing of all the run plays and everything. While Penn State has been carried thus far by its passing game, Landolt realizes the importance of balancing out the offense. There have been teams out there that, that throw 50, 60 times a game or something, but uh, I think it's important for us to get a run game, to get like a run game really going because, uh, you know, it's, it's just a great thing to have. You can control the tempo of the game and just keep the defense honest so they can't just, you know, play pass. Regardless of the situation, Penn State has one last opportunity to get their running game going before the start of the Big Ten play. And if this team truly has aspirations of another Big Ten title in a second consecutive BCS bid, they will have to find that balance. Jed, back over to you.